Well, hello everybody and welcome to a brand new game called Dismantle. Dismantle is a open world action RPG where you can ruin everything. Quite literally, you get to go around and smash things, kill some zombies and stuff like that. Uh, it's got a, um, it, you can explore, you can fight, you can level up, you survive, gather, craft, harvest, hunt, build, farm, solve puzzles, fish, cook, live. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff to do in the game. Um, this is the alpha build. This is version 0.5.9.4. And as of this video, it has, uh, I believe it is out. Um, I think, or maybe the release date isn't uh, official yet. Uh, but the price is going to be uh, $19.99. It, is, uh, it will be in early access, I believe. Um, I think that's everything. Um, yeah, let's dive in. This is an automated recording sent from K23, the Crown Station. Everyone will be provided a safe transit as soon as possible. All right. So the story is that we all do it. We must just to survive, <laughs> just to skip. exist. Can we skip much of this? Okay, so here we are, the caged suburb. That's where we started. Uh, this first part is a little bit um, tutorial. Uh, you start with a uh, crowbar, and you got your health in the top left. Uh, you've got your inventory here. Eventually, you can unlock more spots. You get some special items. Looks like we got some pills right off the bat. Um, you can collect things. Uh, there's metals. There's recipes. There's points of interest. There's different creatures. <laughs> I love that. Uh, and then there's total progress. I spent about five hours yesterday uh, playing on my own and got about 3%. Uh, there, they, there's a lot in it already. You also have to worry about your, uh, the temperature. Um, but as we progress, you'll see, uh, as you upgrade, you'll be able to damage things and get more items. So you can pretty much destroy a lot of things. Well, you can destroy a lot of stuff right off the bat. Um, I will be, uh, playing this on stream as well. Uh, a very, very, uh, much further ahead in the game uh, when this comes out. You'll be wanting to look for these these campfires as they are your save points and uh, you can store everything that you collect in here, um, which is a lot of stuff. Uh, in my opinion, the best thing you want to do is aim to get the uh, knives and the damage on the crowbar as high as possible. Uh, knives would be your secondary action. You don't have to keep clicking for this. You can just hold it down. Um, and these, these exclamation points are also really helpful. I think the game is extremely well, uh, made already. They've, they've put a lot of work into it. There, there's a couple puzzles, not really anything difficult or, um, maddening. What just happened? Was I freezing? That's new. What just happened? Did I get hurt? Here's what happens when you die. You just get to go back and get your loot. That was really weird. I don't know how that happened. I must have gotten stuck or something. Uh, you have your leveling up in the top right. And... Uh, I highly recommend trying to just break everything. Can't break that yet. You can also get a machete, which is super, super helpful. Um, it died again. Was I freezing? That's really weird. Oh, I know why. I know why. And I haven't quite figured out why I have these. Standard Island state issued pills used in situations where there is no way, no other way out. Yeah, we don't want that. I keep accidentally clicking the right button. <laughs> so that's probably a bad thing. Uh, I, the game does a really good job of making it so that you 
kind of have to go certain ways. Um, but it, it doesn't feel horrible, if that makes any sense. Uh, let's grab this. Also, there is the one thing that uh, you'll want to be aware of is um, that while you can uh, just keep going through, you can sleep. Once you unlock a, a sleeping bag, you'll be able to sleep and pass the day, the time, um, which I don't see it. I know eventually once we get through this, uh, there's a time that you'll be able to, to go, uh, upgrade the crowbar at camp. I don't think I can yet. Can I? Let's see. Upgrade gear. Crowbar. Oh yeah. And then you hold it down. Cool. Yeah. Uh, I've been upgrading my backpack on my other game a lot. Like I said, I'm really far ahead in it. Uh, but I didn't want to spoil it for you guys. So now I can break more stuff. Which is fantastic. Who can't break that, huh? I spent so much time just breaking things. Because there's just a lot of stuff you can break. Claim that. Plus these leaves. You'd be surprised how much, how many leaves you need for stuff. I didn't think I did, but... Luckily, that storage bin can hold everything. All working evacuation transports are out. So we'll just keep breaking stuff. Um, I want to get. This is an automated recording sent from K23. Uh, you can search things like this. Get some tomatoes. Uh, and you'll be able to cook stuff to um get. Uh, you can cook stuff to uh, fix your health. Why can't I? Oh, because I'm full up. All right, hold on. Drop all this off. Uh, and then we'll run out. Get out of here. So I want to get out here, and then we can start fighting some stuff. There are bosses. They're not as difficult as you would think. Um, they are a little challenging at first, but not that bad. Whoops. Oh, yeah. That just helps you. Okay, so we come out here. We see this lady. It's an ex-human scrapper. We just... As long as we back up. They do... Every hit they make is a significant amount of damage. But they will always drop something, which is really, really nice. Plastic bags give you plastic. The other cool thing is that these items, they don't despawn, so you can always go back and get them. There's another fire pit, which the fire pits will heal you up and replenish any items. So if I am low on, um, once we level here, I know we will soon. Um... We'll get, uh, like, the, the throwing knives are really good. I like them a lot. That, except, grab this. Uh, there are a few locations that will require uh, some lock picking. Um, can I break this? Nope, not yet. I got my damage up. That's why it almost pays to actually go after them because you can get a bunch of stuff. Ooh, I can upgrade my backpack. Hell yeah, let's do that. Upgrade gear. Okay. You can also track by clicking on this button here. You can track uh, what it's going to take to upgrade, which uh, is actually really nice if you want to just focus on upgrading stuff, which honestly isn't a bad idea, especially since the crowbar is your first and only weapon at the start until you level and you're able to pick other stuff. Uh, you can... Yep. Boop. Boop. 
There you go. Um, you can eventually break everything in this room. Everything. Uh, there's... It just requires you to up, upgrade everything. You can turn the camera around with the middle mouse button. Uh, we'll search this, see what we get out of that. Um, I'm really excited to continue to explore and get better gear as well as uh, learn other recipes. Eventually, you could do some farming. Uh, you got to find the right spot for it. Uh, but there is definitely things you can do to that. It says make tomato soup. I don't want to do that yet. Grab all this. Uh, if you wanted to get rid of something in your inventory, you just click on it. And then you drop it. Uh, but it does make it... And it's not going to despawn. So it's not a huge deal. And you don't have to hold down E to empty out everything. You just click on it. Can I break this yet? Trash can. Okay. Um, like I said before, when you go to sleep, uh, all the zombies respawn, which is frustrating. But the items that you break, I th not all of them will respawn. Um, so we'll come into this guy. This down. These towers are really important because you'll be able to warp uh, fast travel. Between them. And this is the map. This is the size of the whole map. It's huge, man. Um, okay. 24. So somewhere in this area here is something important. Uh, but I haven't been able to explore there. I know there's uh, snow or ice somewhere up. Uh, either up there or down here. Um, and there's a couple other towers. You can open stuff, but... Unfortunately, it's sealed because there's a threat there. That's one of the bosses. Uh, and then on the other side, um, I believe we have to do a bunch of stuff to be able to open that one. Um, because just removing the threat on both sides isn't really going to do it, I think. Might be thinking of another spot. Uh, but now, we can look at our map. We can see a campfire. There's shelter, campfire. There's other things here. There's a quest there, huh? Alright, let's go see what that is. You see the degree, you can see where your location is, you can see the temperature, there's our time. I wonder when that was going to show up. Check this out. Can I break this? Oh, cool. I don't think I've checked this one out yet. Checked everything else out. Ah, level two. Yep, I'm going to do that in a second. Yep, claim that reward, sure, why not? This. Uh, reach. Oh, all right. Return from the requirements of rent. Reach XP level five. Currently. Oh, oh, all right. Uh, you can hold down shift to run so you don't have to walk everywhere. And uh, camping restores your health, replenishes used items, right? Now, I'm getting this. That's the first thing you get. So now you can invent and craft. And this is the whole these are all the different things you can unlock uh cooking pot right you can craft that these are blueprints so they're unlocked this is the one that i want but you need this to be able to craft them um so i need more scrap metal and once we get that it's going to be really uh, helpful as you level up you get more things um i don't think this is level three these are level four yeah there's a lot these say level 50 which seem pretty intense i don't know if those will stay but uh right now i'm like i said there's a lot of awesome stuff in this game um this is just the bare minimum intro i haven't even begun to show you all the other things that you can get do in this game when you die it's not a big deal which I like because I can just as long, you spawn right back over at the fireplace that you were at. Oh, now other ones will hear you if they hear any noise. I'm really excited to start upgrading, but we're going to keep using this 
this uh, this save file. This will be the save file that we'll be playing. I'm going to try to put something out uh, as often as I can. I'm going to try to be more consistent because I just needed some motivation in this game. I am motivated. motivated. Now, if you want to watch this game uh, live, I will be over on twitch.tv slash Mr. Joker. There will be a link down in the description. And if you want to uh, purchase the game or look into it some more, I'll also have a link on uh, Steam for more of this game. Uh, I don't feel like the grind on this game is that bad. Uh, like I said, I lost track of time really quickly. I can't break that yet. Um, like, it, it just five hours went flying by. Oh, I can't break that. Oh, that was just the chair. Can't break that other stuff yet. Okay. Uh, let's go put this stuff away. And then... Can't upgrade... Crowbar yet. Or the backpack. But... What I really want... Can't craft anything yet? Um... Recipes. Ugh. I need to crap. I need to. Yeah. We need more metal. Hey, break that. Definitely need more metal. Go here. Let's um let's track this. Track this because I want to make sure that I get that built. Uh we're gonna build that and then uh I'm gonna save it and we'll come back. Because I really want to show you the Come on. There we go. Got seven. Um, where is some other? Now for tracking, because throwing the. Can I break this? Oh, that works. Ah, we can build these now. Throwing the the arrows or not the arrows the knives can be a little difficult only because um the aim is uh it's based on the middle mouse button can i break that no. um let's see is there oh can i break the trash can Really? All right. Uh, these things here are explosives. They will destroy a lot and damage you, or if not, kill you immediately. You want to kind of be careful of that. Um, my guys. Yep, yep, yep. You can outrun them and go wherever else you want. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot. You can do this. <laughs> I was doing this a lot. You can uh, barrel roll away. Just be careful where you run to because you never know who's around the corner. I have run into quite a mess of zombies. There. All right, we can make our throwing knives now. I want that. Okay. Let's make our throwing knives. I'll show you exactly. That's, that's just what I wanted to do was get to the throwing knives. That away. Set the camp. Vent. Craft. Boom. Heck yes. Okay, now go to uh, inventory. We already have it assigned there. We get four. And in order to replenish them, you have to go to a campsite. All right, so I middle mouse clicked like this, right? And then I right click. Boom, dead. Isn't that nice? Oh, so nice. I just wish I had more of them. Eventually, you can upgrade. Yeah, that's really nice. 
Oh yeah, that's that's uh Oh, that one missed. Yeah, this guy has uh like radioactivity or something. There we go. So we got another monster slain. Um but yeah, uh, I think the game is really good. Uh, I'm really enjoying it. So we're going to see a lot more of this on the channel for a little bit uh, and see how far we can get in it. And because uh, I think the end goal is to escape the island because we're on an island. Yeah. Um, let me know what you think about the game in the comments below. If you're excited about it, I will. Like I said, I'll be playing this particular save on YouTube, but uh, the much further along game will be on uh on the stream which is monday through sunday through friday yeah so tomorrow uh or today when you see this i might actually be live thanks for watching and i will catch you guys next time i'm out